All right. Sinead, I want you to tell the fans mm -hmm. what you did last night. Um, so last night, <laughs> it was uh, National Ice Cream Day yesterday. Boom. So I uh, made myself a very large ice cream sundae, Neapolitan, my fave. Okay. And then I put on the premiere of Game of Thrones. I have never seen Game of Thrones. I think I've only known about it from being on the show and a little bit here and there just through social media and stuff like that so i did watch it um, in your defense pretty little liars is the game of thrones of free 100 percent for sure <laughs> um but i did watch it i did write a really awesome synopsis okay spoiler heavy okay um but i did write a synopsis about all my thoughts while i watched the show okay before we get into our actual game of thrones review from the uh, let's let, i would love to hear Sinead's <laughs> synopsis of season seven Episode one, Game of sure. Thrones. So, spoiler alert, of course. Yeah, yeah. right. You know, spoiler alert. There you go. There Throw up go. the spoiler um, alert. Also written in a uh, pink gel pen. <laughs> <laughs> I bought a fresh gel pen from Blix yesterday just for this occasion. Now, can, you, can you explain for the audience and myself? What is a gel pen? A gel pen is um, a right. It's like a pen. Yeah, right? mm -hmm. a regular a pen. Yeah. pen mm -hmm. But the actual ink that's in there is like like velvety, mm -hmm. silky. I guess is the way you could describe it. Like, look yeah. how it shines. Yeah, oh, it's, it's, it's very it's lovely. It's very lovely. Yeah. yeah. Mm. All right, you guys and, ready? And there's nothing says Game of Thrones quite like a pink gel pen, which I don't know if you guys noticed, but when Samuel Tarley was in the uh, in in the Citadel, he was using a pink gel he pen was, to take a, notes. Exactly, yeah, to as take do, notes as and, and write yeah. in his journal about yeah. how he dreamed and of going in the forbidden shit section. Buckets, but yes, <laughs> yes. No, that montage. Okay, we today, will get to that. Let's okay? crush it. All right. Winter has come, so Filch is celebrating with the feast. <laughs> and by celebrating, I mean murdering them. And by Filch, I mean Maisie Williams, who's clearly a crazy bitch. <laughs> now there are more crazy people who look like they belong in The Walking Dead. Also, the BFG. Now some kid named Stark has come to warn of the Night King, but I've already forgotten what they were talking about because Jon Snow and his sexy man bun are preparing for war or something, but everybody's getting on his case, especially this redhead bitch, but his decision oh is God. final. Now Cersei is walking around on a map listing all the people that she hates, which apparently is like everybody, but whatever, because her leather ball gown is magnificent. <laughs> um, now some guy with a really bad British accent wants to marry Cersei. I'm pretty sure this guy's from like Ohio, but now I'm looking away because bedpan shit, which is totally uncalled for. Also, dead man peen, also uncalled for. Side note, I still have no effing clue why everybody is so mad. Maybe they're cold? What the actual fuck is Ed Sheeran doing? Oh, he's leading his Cub Scouts troop in a campfire song. Cute. Maisie's come to join. Ed Sheeran must have a really big crush on her because he's so nervous that he hasn't said a damn word. Now, there's some more cold people looking into a magical fire. One of them is really mad, but I don't blame him because I'd be livid if I only had one eyebrow. Okay, some guy with a scary arm just gave me a fright. It's scaly, and it looks like you should really get that shit checked out or, like, put some moisturizer on it. Ooh, finally some dragons. Now Daenerys is checking if the sand is wet. It is. <laughs> Her braids are so pretty. Peter Dinklage is here too. They're about to play a really large board game, I think. Oh, show's over. <laughs> hey guys, if you like this video, click the thumbs up button. Also, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel. It'll help you stay up to date with everything we've got going on here at Collider.